right everyone I've got a project here it's just a flower I'm making this is some of my uh, vintage style um, lace I I will get it in a I've never sold it in the shop because it was expensive but I liked it and I needed it for a project so um, I did buy myself some but if I do come across it I will get it in for the shop because you know some people might want to own it but it's just the flower I'm making um, I'm going to do a double layered flower and I've already cut some leaves that I will be doing something with maybe if not I will use them somewhere else now what I've done is I've taken I can just share with you um, 14 scallops so with and this is a, a one and three quarter inch lace in width and then I've got one that's an inch because like I said it's going to be um, a double layered flower I like making the vintage ones uh, full flowers um, this is how I became known for making my flowers and um, I do see many people using the same technique and the lady from the Netherlands that keeps putting the thumbs down we know who you are because it shows on the count and um, please you know if you're gonna put thumbs down then at least say why you're doing it don't just thumb down every single video um, we know you're from the Netherlands because it's coming up on the um, analytics and it shows you where you live so people think we don't know well we do <laughs> it's every video and it's silly you see you could be doing that to somebody who um, isn't used to having the thumbs down or um, might take offense uh, it might if they're a new crafter and they're just sharing the first videos and you put your thumbs down on the, those as well if you're doing it to me you'll do it to others um, you could put them off for life from posting and that's wrong because then you're depriving other people to learn what somebody else has learnt which isn't nice and it's not nice anyway without explaining it you know if you if you don't like it just don't bother by putting the thumbs down doesn't mean to say that uh, nobody knows who you are I do because it tells me where you're from and I only have to go back and look at my list anyway so I'm just joining these two bits up here just join the edges together pull that in so it's out the way I absolutely adore this uh, lace I use it very very rarely in fact I've only got one small piece left of this that's it and um, one piece of that same length as that and then one a little bit wider than this one I have the two and a half inch three inch wide I think it is but hey who cares right I'm just that'll do so that's the first one done but all I'm going to do for the, oh do you know I plugged that in and left the lead off my gl uh, me glue gun <laughs> right <sighs> plugged the glue gun on in and then left it now look see I absolutely love this flower and what we do is we just spin it round and round and round until it's all ruffled as it should be and it lays kind of uh, flattish like that that's it beautiful flower really nice so I'm just going to put that to one side and I will glue that later yeah I just don't understand why people do it they don't think of the consequences personally myself I couldn't care less if you want to put your thumb you know thumbs down for me go ahead and do it but it would worry me that you are doing it to people as well Um, obviously if you're just doing it because you don't like a video 
there's no need to put your thumbs down there really shouldn't be there that uh, thumbs up thumbs down thing I don't agree with it but if you are doing it just to be a bitch because of uh, you don't like my videos then don't watch them that's easily done isn't it when you're doing it on every single video and I've looked at the analytics and it's all come from the Netherlands then obviously you know you're doing it for a particular reason aren't you it's alright because I'll just have you traced I know you're from the Netherlands and I'll just have your IP address tra uh, traced so I know exactly who it is and then have you blocked completely because that's what we do with people we don't have negative people on my channel at all not allowed if it was the odd video it wouldn't bother me um, you know when I mean, well, it don't bother me anyway I just don't want you to go ahead and do it to other people but I mean you are doing it on every single video of mine when I click on the analytics on every uh, video that's the thumbs down on it shows you from the Netherlands and it's quite childish really you know if you want to continue being a acting like a kid I mean if you're a kid fair enough but if you're a grown person man or woman doesn't matter to me and you're acting like that you should be ashamed of yourself but we'll trace the call anyway. We'll trace the uh, thingy anyway. Just get YouTube to do it. So I'm a YouTube partner. <laughs> and um, they're often in touch. So there you go. I've found people before. Look, isn't that pretty? There's just no need for it. Right, come on glue gun, heat up. So that's that. Now I've got to find something that's, because uh, that's going to go in there like that. Isn't that beautiful? Um, so I've got to find something that's kind of like old fashioned. I mean, I could put these in, I absolutely. Where's the, I could put them in there, right. But no, I want a bit of bling. I've got a loose hair on my, um, body sweat. I thought something was creeping around on me. No, wrong colour. Oh, look. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty. Well, I could use that. No. I just have to delve into my little box and see what I've got. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, that's even... See, that's brown though, and that's not. That's more vintage, isn't it? I might use that one. Let's have a look what this one is. Nope. I could just use that. Too bright. Let's have a look. No. No, no, no. I mean, I'm just going to keep that out just in case. I do have lots of different things that I could use. I'm just not sure what. See, that's beautiful. It was an earring, look. I'm not even sure if it was an earring, actually. It hung on to something. But it's not quite big enough, I don't think. No, I want something I can see. I think I'm going to choose that. I think, I think, I think. Right, let's see if it's ready. So, take the glue stick out so we can start a fresh one. Just want to make sure I'm not going to run out of glue. Okay, okay. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop it on here. Like that. So, just like that for now. And you can hear the kids outside playing. 
They'll play for so long, then they'll get fed up. It gets boring for them, you know, these six weeks holidays. They should, should cut them down, really. After four weeks, they're all ready to go back to school. I know parents are ready to get rid of them. Right. So now, I just have to get that, like, that. Like that. And then this can cut right across there. Like that. And push that in. You see how it's done that? Now, I just need to put a little bit of glue on there. Make that meet. And I don't need to do it on that one, I don't think. That's it. Yeah, I like that. That's pretty. That gorgeous. Now, do I actually want to put leaves on? I don't know. <laughs> but what I'm going to do, if I get my tweezers, now, we just need to grab them like that. Take the flame. And press that down and that gives you the leaf like that now what I can do if it will work is you just heat it up in a place and crinkle it for those of you that don't know Sorry, I hope this has been in view. Like that. See, and you make it more natural. I am going to put this on. Before I put the backing on. Now, I want one there. Like that. And then I'm going to take another one. So now is it? Come on, mate. Like that. That's it. Like that. And then we're just going to go. You just go to bend it, burn it. And then you just twist in the material. This is really good quality ribbon, and I buy it in bulk like that. Um, where I think I bought that one on the market uh, from a friend of mine. That particular one. I don't know how many leaves I want to put on here. I might just put two. Two on like that. Just pull that back, a little bit of glue there and there. Pull that one back, a little bit of glue, just to secure them onto the flower. Yeah. I don't think we need any more than that. But that's a nice flower. Now what I can do... Um, I want a pin. Let me just see if I've got a nice pin. I, mean, I have lots of different pins. But I've got pink. I need a pink one. And I've got this one. It's got a bead and a bead cap on it like that. Which um, needs sorting out, to be honest. Yeah. Just pop a little bit of glue on there. Oh, 
that puts that back in like that um, I could use see what beads I've got I will have pink crystals let me just find a nice bead I'm going to actually put the round on there first then that then another roundel. I don't want that one now. <laughs> yeah, they're the colours, I think. Are they? No. <laughs> Where's the pearls I had the other day? Here. That's it, I think. Yeah, I like that. And I think we'll have a bead cap for that. Let me get my bead cap jar out. Let's just see, here we are. I like these. They're just like a flower. Well, that do perfect. Perfect. Oh, that's that's lovely. Look at that. Quite pretty. You see, nothing too much. You don't need to have too much. Now, I'm going to stick this in here. Like that there. And that way, I'll need it to go onto that leaf there. It can be seen. See, like that? Even though that's oval, it still can be seen nicely. Like that. That's really pretty. Now, I don't know, I might do another one yet. Yeah, I've got some uh, some really nice material now. That's that one anyway, so that shows you how to do them. Uh, nice vintage flowers. But um, I got that fabric, didn't I? Do you remember that one? So I'm going to do this one, I think. Oh, and I got the white one out as well. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Is that long enough? We're going to do 16. 16 on that because it's a smaller scallop. So let's just have a look. Oops. Right. Where's my needle gone? Here we are. Now, I don't have one that is smaller um, than this one, you know, to do a, a double one, but I'm just going to do this. Right. And then what I do is just run the glue over the edge. A lot of people stitch them. I don't find the need to do that. And you can just give them a quick glue. And we just keep doing that until it flattens itself a little bit. like that now that's bonnie now i do oh now i've got this here beautiful but it's got a stone missing so i'm going to put that stone back in but before i do that i'm just going to glue this on and then i'll put the stone back in And if you push down slightly, now here's my little jar with the uh, stone flowers, uh, the stone flowers, the little gems. I think that one will do. Oops. Yeah, all I need then, my glossy accents. Like that.
turn my stone over and pop whoops and pop that in there see and that's what you get when you keep hold of everything <coughs> So, we're going to need one for that now, aren't we? Now, I do have this this one I showed the other day, beautiful flat, um, stick pin, and I might use it for that, actually. Yes, I like that. So, I'm going to make... I've got one leaf there. It is nice to make them with leaves. Oh, get in there. It's going to play silly buggers because it's a long leaf. There we go. Beautiful. And that's just about dried in there. They're pretty. Really pretty flowers. I will put back to them, like I say. I think we'll do another one. I love making flowers. Absolutely love it. I could sit and make flowers all day long. Uh, we're going to do the white one, I think. That's lovely, isn't it? Um, and I might use... Let me see if I can use a doily or something. Do I want a doily? I want something for the middle. <coughs> this is not quite big enough, I don't think. No, but I like that. There we go. Peel that off. Pop that on. I don't know that I want to do that now. I want a more. Um, I'm going to use this. This blends in well with it. So I just need to get my pliers. Yeah, I like that. Oops, I've done it already. And that, oh yes, that's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, that is just what I want. 
So now we need to find uh, a stick pin that will go in that. And I have got some really nice ones. These already made up. So I'm going to use that without stabbing myself, I think. Yep. Um, let's make the leaves. I think we'll just do two. I would recommend that you buy some ribbon, broad ribbon, because it does look really nice and you make the leaves you want. That's it. That's another one. So I hope that's been helpful to you. Um, yes, I hope you've been able to see those. Um, thanks for watching, take care and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye bye for now.